We've seen an explosion of clinical and research evidence demonstrating how ketogenic therapy can treat or even put into remission serious cases of depression or bipolar disorder, schizophrenia, and other brain-based disorders as well as metabolic disorders. But we often hear from individuals and clinicians alike that, yeah, sure, it may work, but it's too hard to sustain or it's too expensive or my medical practice can't support someone through this transition. Well, this publication demonstrates that none of those claims need to be true. This paper was published in Frontiers in Nutrition and was the result of the one year experience of 50 patients taking part in a metabolic health and weight loss clinic. And as I mentioned, the results were stunning. 82% of the individuals maintain the ketogenic diet at one year. 82%. That's some of the best dietary retention that I've seen published. Now it's true, this was not a randomized controlled trial and that's what makes it real world data. And that's what shows that in the real world with support, ketosis is definitely a sustainable intervention. I mean, that's a crucial conclusion that we all need to internalize. And this wasn't just a little weight loss. The patients lost on average 43 pounds that was sustained at one year. And that's over 15% of their body weight and went along with impressive metabolic health benefits. This is on par with or even better than the data supporting GLP-1 medications like Ozempic and Wagovi. 